Hello everyone, myself Bharadwas. In this video, I will discuss about latching relay. Nothing but latching concept in PLC. Open your software and on the left side, scroll down and select latching relay and click here. Latching relay is nothing but RS flip flop. Okay. So go to properties and write comment latching relay. If you see, there are two inputs S input, R input, and one output. So you need two inputs and one output. Again, go to top and select digital input and select one output. Connect here. I will take I3 and give the command. This is my S input. S means set. Connect and the second one. Okay, the first one I will take I1 only. Second one I will take I3. And this is my R input. For easy learning purpose, I will take one more output. Q2. This is my output one. And this is my output two. Okay. And this one, I will directly connect S input. This output two, it is input is coming from the S input directly. Now open the hardware and give the download. If you see the output one is taken with latching relay and output two is taken without latching relay for S input. Program is downloading. If you don't have the hardware with you, no problem. Just do the simulation and touch the logic. Now I will go to online. Meanwhile, like our videos and share the videos with your friends and network. Okay, the download is completed. If you see the latching relay, just right click on the block and go to help and scroll down. If you see, this is the truth table. If you see, my set input is 0 and R input is 1, output is reset. Reset means 0. Similarly, if set input is 1, R input is 0, output is 1. That means set. If both are 0, 0, the status is unchanged. Previously, if it is an on state, then on will be there. 
if it is in off state off will be there if both are high then again output is reset in this block r is having the high priority remember that okay so we will test it first i will press s input and observe the difference between with latching and without latching this q1 output 1 is with latching and output 2 is without latching for a push button switch okay now see i will press the input 1 here in the hardware okay and i will press it and again i will release it you see now i press the input i1 i'm just holding it like that if you see input i1 is on and the latching relay output is on q1 is on this s input is directly connected to q2 that is why q2 is also on both outputs are on remember i am holding this switch now now i will release the switch what happened the q1 is still on but q2 is off because the q2 is directly connected with s input it will not store any status it will not save the data it will only take the input from the s input directly in some cases you need to hold the bit for some time or for some application to finish okay in that case latching is very important Suppose this is my start bit, motor start bit. Okay. When I want to start the motor, then I will press this button input one. Then what happens? Motor will be started and it will run continuously when the latching is there. If there is no latching, then again the output will be off immediately. So this is the advantage with latching relay. Even though the input is off, the output will still remains on. If I want to clear the output, then I have to press the R input, reset input. I have to give the reset one time. Remember, this is only require a pulse, continuous or a pulse, on and off. If S is zero and if I give only R input, output is off. Now what I will do, I press the input I1, that means set is 1, R input R is 0, output is on, Q1, just only see the Q1. Now I will make both inputs off, S input, R input off. Status is unchanged, right? If both inputs are 0, 0, the output remains unchanged. It will hold the previous value. Previously it is in on state. Pre in previous cycle now also it is an on state if i want to clear the in output i have to give the r input if i give both s and r simultaneously then output is off q1 is off okay here we have to consider only the q1 for understanding the latching relay the q2 is only taken such that you can see the difference between latching relay without latching relay so this is all about latching relay remember this is very simple and important concept in plc logics if you have any experience with the latching concept in plc's share with us in what type of application you use the latching concept with us through the comment section thank you i will meet you in the next video